Hey planner friends, welcome to another video. Uh, today I am going to flip through May pages in my B6 Telogy notebook and show you the spreads that I was using uh, throughout this month. Uh, if you are first time here, welcome. My name is Gorica and on this channel you can find plan with me's, flip throughs and other B6 Telogy related videos and I will put the link to my Instagram in the description box down below. So let's get started. Uh, these first two pages uh, didn't change uh, since my uh, latest video. Uh, I have here my uh, illustration portrait made by Serbian artist dotted by Jovana. Uh, next is this Moon Faces calendar, a yearly calendar, uh, mood board and vision board. And uh, this is my uh, yearly mood tracker with uh, tracking some additional things and uh, I was pretty consistent with this uh, during May uh, except for this week I was on a vacation with my family uh, half of this uh, period and first few days I don't know I cannot recall why I didn't use this uh, so basically that's uh, it when it comes to this spread next is my monthly tasks list uh, tracker and now uh, we are in my monthly so if you're first time here i have all my monthlies uh, next to each other and after that i have all the weeklies so basically this is may uh, calendar and it's very similar to all the other uh, monthly calendars uh, this is uh, very important for my uh, functional planning uh, this is where all, all the uh, appointments go, events, uh, monthly uh, to-do list and as you can see uh, I put some washi and sticker here and there so this is how my April looked like uh, I would also uh, put the highlighter on the day which was very enjoyable and uh, this is the highlighter for uh, my vacation week uh, what I also do on my uh, monthly, I'm tracking uh, when I filmed the video, when I posted it. Uh, I would also circle the date when it's uh, over and that is part of my like evening planning routine. Uh, I'm also putting holidays uh, if I was going somewhere by myself or with my family. Uh, I would also put uh, like the day when the new episode of some TV show is uh, coming out. For example, the bold type is on Wednesday and uh, Grace Anatomy is on Thursday. Uh, I'm usually not watching that the day when it comes out, but uh, it's a reference for me. Uh, I usually watch that on the weekends. And uh, this is my monthly to-do list. Uh, and basically that is it. I did okay, but um, I did procrastinate on some things, for example, uh, cleaning my phone, uh, memory on my phone, basically, because um, it's very not enjoyable for process for me. Uh, I'm always like struggling with uh, phone memory. I had some like um, process and I followed it for some time, but it didn't work at the end. So. I don't know, I, I need to organize my videos and my photos and I don't know how to do that. I watched a lot of videos on um, on YouTube and basically it does help me organize my current photos and I guess it's kind of like a project but uh, maintaining that it's a struggle for me so uh, I don't know, I have to really dive into this and find a way to uh, keep my phone clean so uh, that is my monthly and now uh, we are in my weeklies so how I separated all the months is I have monthly tracker and then all the weeks for that month and after that I have monthly memories and after that everything is the same so uh, as you can see my accent color uh, for all the months since January until uh, the end of May are this Faber Castell in beige red uh, one th uh, three two, and the second one is this uh, warm gray two seven two. 
uh, but I realized that after using it for a while I kind of get bored with that so I decided to change uh, my accent colors uh, to this Faber Castell um, pastel gray and this Stabilo pink it's also like in pastel and as I realized I'm always going towards like the uh, kind of like um, uh, pink pastel pink and gray so I also have um, that pair in a uh, Tombow dual brush pen also pink and gray so uh, just a side note uh, that is what I'm using as my highlighters and as my pen I am using this uh, Uniball Signo uh, Micro 207 in 0 0.5 deep and I really like it so basically in May I was tracking uh, Instagram posts uh, separately from house things uh, and these two I didn't use and it didn't work basically uh, so these are things that I'm changing and also some things that I'm tracking here are uh, the TV show or the movies that I watched uh, if I was reading a book so during May I watched the Rails, uh, I read one book and we were on a vacation so it was very fine month I guess and now we are in my weeklies so all the weeklies look the same i have a little monthly uh, calendar some weekly tracker and things that i need to do during that week and then monday to wednesday and thursday to sunday and basically how i'm using this uh, i'm just documenting everything that happened during the day and uh, these uh, things that are i just cross are my to-do list and on the day that I had a lot of work or I didn't do anything fun I would just write down some quote or something interesting that I read online or in a book uh, next I have this page and I did a video for this uh, it's my evening planning routine uh, if you're interested uh, I will put a link in the description box down below and all the weeklies are very similar. I have some washes, stickers over that. I would highlight uh, interesting things. For example, if I did something interested with my family or friends, it's this like beige, uh, beige um, a highlighter. And if it's something only me related, it's highlighted with gray. And uh, that is it. Something that I would like to work on is my weekly to-do list. I'm not referencing this very often, but I would like to. So that is something to work on. Uh, on this day, uh, I had to do some packing uh, because we were going on a trip on 10th of May. So I didn't write basically anything here. And I didn't touch my notebook. And uh, that is it. And this is the week of a vacation. I wasn't using uh, my Stalogy during this uh, trip. I did have it with me, but I just didn't open it. So uh, this was back planned. And uh, this part here was uh, empty, so I decided to put this. And I added some travel stickers, also by Serbian brand. And that is it. Uh, we came back, we were uh, at home the end of the week and I have some stickers, washi, I really like this, I used that same thing here too, this is from the same kit and um, it's very cute I guess. So next page uh, on this week I got this uh, sticky notes as a present and I really like this so I'm not I cannot find like the functional uh, use of sticky notes when it comes to like weekly planning because I have uh, enough space uh, on basically the daily but I really like how it looks so for example on this day I used the, this as some kind of a uh, um, to-do list but I actually could write that here so 
I don't know, it just looks nice, I guess. It's not the functional thing, but I enjoy this. Uh, another stickers and washi. Uh, next week, uh, I really like how this looks. Another um, sticky note, and this is the same like pack. And uh, I love this sticker, it's very beautiful. And this one too, it just, I love this spread. Uh, I had a, a longer to-do to list here. Next spread, uh, very similar to the previous ones. I was going to the office on this day and I really enjoyed it actually because I was working for, from home for a long time now and it was very nice to see other people working around you, I guess. Uh, by the way, when it comes to COVID situation is in Serbia, it's kind of going back to normal and that is the end of may and here are all the pictures that i think marked uh, the month and i really enjoy looking at the photos at the end of the month i don't know it's very nice uh, so basically uh, that is it after that is my june tracker and uh, at the back i have my monthly running to-do list some journaling pages and uh, some things like, uh, I don't know, projects, credit card uh, debt, inbox index and stuff like that. But uh, there is a lot of journaling too. And uh, that is it. I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Uh, if you did, uh, consider subscribing and thank you very much for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye!